Applying a Monte Carlo simulation to your cash flow forecast can help create a more robust plan and gives your clients added peace of mind. To get started, you'll need to choose a client and then select the cash flow modeler. You can then either apply a Monte Carlo simulation to an existing forecast or in this example, click the clone button to create a new forecast for the Monte Carlo simulation separately. Here, choose your forecast name and alter the start dates if required. Then, click Create. On this page, head to the Stress Testing and Monte Carlo tab and then select Monte Carlo. When you're ready, select the appropriate Savings Pot and then click Run Monte Carlo Simulation to get started. Here, you can enter a minimum threshold for the Savings Pot if you require. If you have saved asset allocation templates, you can select it from the drop down box. You should also check the client risk profile and change this on the slider if required. You can also adjust the asset allocation average. Just click the pencil and alter the digit to what you require. Now you're ready to run 10,000 different Monte Carlo simulations on the savings part. Once the simulations have been run, you'll be able to view the number of simulations that stayed and ended above your threshold. You'll also be able to see a graph which shows the average optimistic and pessimistic lines. The average line represents the median of all simulations in a year. This means in any given year, 50% of the simulations are above the line and 50% below. The optimistic and pessimistic lines represent the 25th percentile and 75th percentile. This means that the optimistic line will have 25% of simulations performing better and 75% performing worse. You can also check the money in versus money out against this individual savings pot. Once done, select Save Simulation. You can now view and edit this along with printing a standalone report.